Greetings YouTube, this is Hyper Librarian coming at you with a deck profile. I built another Pokemon deck. In the previous one I did a Salamence build, but this time it's more or less just EX ridiculousness. Um, this deck has one major flaw, and that is that it runs literally only all the Pokemon except for four Pokemon or EXs, so any EX tech deck you can just scoop against because you're you're either going to hit with Zekrom or you're not going to be able to hit at all. So, yeah, play at your own risk. But otherwise, it's fun to build. Let's start this thing out with the pokes, as always. Start everything out off with I have one Mewtwo EX. I am planning on getting a Mewtwo EX Y, the Mega. Um, it's similar, it does similar to X-Ball, except for it's a base 10, and then it does 30 times the number of energy. So, you're guaranteed at least, I think it's like 70 damage, I think, at one of the first attacks. I think, I know why we're sure on that. Check to make sure. I run two Hoopa EXs. Um, just for that search engine, just so I can keep on getting my Pokemon, because like I said, everything, nearly everything is an EX, so I can keep searching, keep playing, all that good stuff. One Hydreigon. One Garatina EX. Garatina EX, why I run him, is I can say no to any damage from Megas, and plus Chaos Win can pretty much shut someone down, make it to where they really can't really do anything. One Latio CX, um, just for that first turn, uh, possible hit. If not, um, it's still there as a backup. One Mega Latios EX, pretty much what he can do is he can attack anything your opponent has for the cost of just two energy. You could, and plus he has a free retreat cost on his own, so you can use him as just a wall, just for a little bit, retreat him back, bring something up, else up, and finish it if you need to, or you can bring him in as a finisher. I run three regular Rayquaza. Um, you'll see why in a minute why I run three of them. But these two, like I said previous in my silence video, I wish both of them had the sphere in the hand, but oh well, I'll do what I can. And he lets me search for the mega versions. And speaking of which, I run three megas. Two of them happen to be the Emerald Break, and one of them is the Dragon Ascension version. And yes, that is the secret rare. I was fortunate enough to get that off of a friend of mine. And I'm very glad for it. Now, I wish this one was. What's <laughs> your favors? But, um, but if you look at the artwork, yes. Right? It's facing the center. Facing the center. He's in the center. Oh. Let your OCD rest with that. Oh. I run, speaking of Zekrom, I run two Zekrom. The ones I run is the Energy Storm version to help recycle your energy back, because him plus energy pouch, um, yeah, you can get all your energy back, pretty much straight to your hand. It's similar to energy retrieval, but this one does 30 damage, so. And to finish the Pokemon off, I run two Soul Rocks, just to search out those special energies, which are necessary for the deck to run consistently. Without the special energies, the deck would still run relatively well. It just would be a lot, a lot slower. And in this, now you need speed more than you need, um, well, anything else, honestly. So they help. Especially when I run a ridiculous amount of EXs and each one requires at least two to attack. So, yeah. Onto the trainers. I run two energy pouch. Four letters to help increase efficiency with my energy since I run so little. Two recycler, two trainer's mail, 
two super scoop just in case I need a free out I need it back to my hand I need those energy I don't have anything else really to put out and I need to get something else out if you open Hoopa get it back yeah all that good <laughs> stuff two receiver two ultra ball one Latios spirit link two Rayquaza spirit link two Shauna one Lysander two Tierno two Skyla two Center Lady. And finally, for the energy, I only run three of each of these, so fire, water, electric, double colorless, and finally double dragon. And that does it for my EX tech build. Like I said previously, any deck that is anti-EX in any way will pretty much shut this deck down faster than a for alligator law for alligators seismitoad law so play at your own risk but it is extremely fun to play this has been hyper librarian signing out don't forget the sparkle <laughs>